How are you beautiful people doing? It is I, the Task at Hand, and I'm back at it again. Now, today we're bringing you, you know, it, I feel like it's going to be a little bit longer of a video, depending on how long it takes me to really explain it, talk about what uh, we're going to talk about today. As you can see in the title, you know, we're talking about Blackout. Everything Blackout. My thoughts on it, you know, after being, I think it's been like a week since the beta's gone, you know, and it's just the beta, by the way. Just the beta. Excuse me. Um, how do I feel about it? I'm going I'm to I'm tell you a couple things, right? I'm going to tell you what's amazing about it. Like, what I like about it. I'll tell you what I don't like about it. Um, I'll tell you what needs to be improved. You know what I'm saying? Like, the things that will just fucking bring it to that next level shit, right? You know what I mean? And um, the thing... Or why I feel like it's so important, right? Why this game mode is so important and like what it did to like or what it's doing currently to like the community you know and just the beta too just the beta that <laughs> this is that beta level like imagine it's only up from here literally literally so right off the bat what i want to talk about are the things that are like not good ready the things that are not good about it one of the big things um that we could talk about is um armor uh, or, or body armor that's one of the things that really needs to get or not not really needs to like get out but that's one of the things that are like kind of tricky now ready watch here in this gameplay um now of course he's on a head glitch but as you've seen i literally shot the dude and then he was able to just shoot back at me without like no hesitation he shot back at me and he just destroyed me destroyed me instantly which is some wild shit to me. That's fucking insane. Now, if you see in the bottom left, I grabbed body armor level two. Now with body body armor level two, I think it's fifth. No, it's forty percent. I think it goes th um, level one's thirty percent. Level two is forty percent, and then level three armor is f I think it's fifty percent. If I'm not wrong, it's fifty percent. Um, bullet damage, right? It reduces the da or it decreases. 50% of the damage that's incoming to or, or incoming bullet damage. That's what it does. That's what armor does, right? Or, or th uh, level three armor. It decreases 50% of the damage incoming to you from bullets. Now, it also is resistant to flashbangs, concussions. Ex it does less. You do. Ha you take less explosive damage, and you're immune to fire. Like, I don't understand why they put that. That's ridiculous. That's insane. That's like like uh that would be just very very bad that's not just bad that's like horrible needs to get patched before the game even comes out or when like coming into this next game they got to remove that like either, my solution for that like ready straight up how they'll fix it i'm not going to tell you just what's bad like i'm not here to fucking uh bash the game i'm also here to he got destroyed by that cluster grenade cluster grenades are ridiculous um i'm not here to just you know bash the game obviously i love the game so i'm gonna tell you what's wrong like the things that are wrong and I'll, I'll suggest how to fix it in the same breath. Um, I think how to fix it, make level three super fucking rare to get. You got to make it super, super rare. I'm talking like, like how Fortnite be making certain things like, you know, their rarity goes to like gold things are super rare. Make this shit so fucking like, make it really rare. You know what I mean? Um, and this whole resistant to flash stuns and all that shit. Take that out. Nope. Nope. Resistant to fire. Fuck that. I don't care. It shouldn't have any of those additional things. And also, um, for in, in terms of bullet damage, it should be tuned down. Like, there's no way, just because I found something, that it gives you that much of a fucking advantage. Like, especially in this, where everything's projectiles anyway, and it's already super hard to kill people sometimes. And, like, it's really wonky. Because, like, or, or it's not, I wouldn't say wonky, but it's really, like just up in the air sometimes because it's again it's projectiles like your bullets aren't hit scan they're more projectiles now so or in this mode so that like just adding that level three man that just fucking damn like that just fucks you up like so much it's just not it's op it's overpowered you there's good things and then there's things that are just like holy shit this needs to get fixed or taken out and at first i was saying take it out but they're talking about not taking it out because they uh they had a tweet saying that's like the wrong play to do. They, uh, I think it was Vonderhaar or just the Treyarch team in general. They were like, um, the wrong thing to do would be to take out um, 
uh, level three entirely. Uh, we're, we're, I mean, I'll, I'll, I agree. I agree, you know, because I thought about it. And another way I remember, or I was thinking of, to like, you know, kind of balance the fact that there's armor in here and uh, making, and ha so armor plus projectile bullets plus like bullet drop, like it just makes even higher time to kills and I'm, or time to kill. And I'm just like, you know, what's another thing that could probably fix it? Uh, armor piercing rounds, putting like, why isn't that in um, blackout? It's in multiplayer, but it's not in here. Um, I definitely think they should put armor piercing rounds in here. Like, uh, just have it be a pickup and just like every other, like, you know, like it can go into any gun. It doesn't have to be like 7.2, nine millimeter, uh, 0.368 or whatever the fuck. Like it can just straight up be AP rounds and any gun can pick it up and any gun can use it. You know, just have that. Um, I don't know. You pick up like 30 at a time or some shit or two clips at a time. Boom. That's fixed. So that's one of the bad things like out of the way you know bad thing uh suggested and method of balancing it out or fixing it i also you know told you about that now the second one doesn't really can like it pertains to blackout too because uh like so here here's the thing it's more of like a general thing like it's the entire game but it looks like shit like this looks like 720p quality this is ripped or record recorded from a stream um on youtube so it looks like 720 quality like all the time like 720p or like even a little less i mean it doesn't even look it doesn't look sharp there we go it doesn't look sharp it looks like a little lower than 780p no bullshit you know like there's no the thing about this is no like super crisp clear pixels uh it's kind of pixely now this has always been a thing since uh the beta itself which um why it's probably just because i'm gonna i'm gonna go ahead and be optimistic and say oh yeah yo this part i i shit on so many people here with with the bear look, look, look. did i hit the shot i can't remember boom oh my lord there's more there's like fucking three more or some shit like that so um for some reason it's like it just looks pixely bro i don't, I don't know why it's uh, maybe because it's just the beta but the graphics is just shit on the graphics are just not crisp at all uh black ops 3 looks t this motherfucker playing migos out there um the graphics just don't look crisp at all i don't know what it is uh, like again i'm just like if this game comes out and it looks the same way i'm gonna be annoyed you know this is fucking this is a 2018 cod what the fuck why is black ops 3 look better than this you know what i mean like this is fucking that's, that's not good. That's bad. You know, we should, as a community, straight up, like the entire COD community, we got to complain about that, man. I hope we make a big noise about that because I don't want to play a fucking 560p game. What the hell? It's 2018, bro. Everything should have crisp 1080p 60 frames a second. Like, there's no excuse if you don't have that in your game. You know what I mean? Don't know why Destiny 2 is still not fucking 60 frames. It's 30. Some bullshit. And it's uncapped frames on PC, but that's a whole different discussion. That's a different video. I'm not going to do that video, but that's for another video for somebody else. But that's one of the things um, that's bad. Uh, up the graphics. Make it true 1080p. We have the consoles that can do it just fine. Completely okay. None of them is native 1080p. None of that bullshit. We, no. We have a PS4, or some of us have the Pro. And even Xbox One X's. Like, just don't. I don't want to hear that i just don't want to hear an excuse you know what i mean to make it better straight now um i was trying to think of more things that i could say that are like bad about this but um i couldn't really like think of them at like right now like off the top of my head those are the things that stick out to me the most you know what i mean other than that like i mean there's other things little things that are kind of like nitpicking at this point um i would say the colors for like your triangle and your teammates name or triangle looks super bland like it should pop out more but that's like like little quality of life things i do ready 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 shit on i just i just i was fucking just picking them up anyway um all the things would be kind of like nitpicking i mean another thing actually i i could hit you with this one thing that i feel like a lot of people didn't 
see this too much or I didn't see people complain about this too much. But actually, I'm going to throw it up there. Awareness. There's a part in this game where I use awareness. Oh, wait, no, it's not right here. I use awareness to hear somebody and holy shit, bro, awareness. You can see mother, bro, you can hear people from no bullshit across like from. Oh, my God. Hold on, I'm going to try to I'm going to edit the clip in. Now in that clip, I literally had awareness shit on. Oh, I don't. I didn't hit that. That was weird. In that clip, bro, I literally I had awareness on. Right, I had awareness on, and I was just sitting in the corner. Yeah, that's how you gotta play. Don't talk shit. That's how you gotta play in solo. If you're trying to get that dub, you, you gotta play. Excuse me, you gotta play like a bitch. Listen, you don't need no headset. I was I heard it on my speaker. You can literally, and bro, if you think that's bad, dog, I swear on everything. I wish I had, like, I didn't, my dumbass didn't record, like, clips and shit <coughs> from me playing. But no bullshit, I can hear from here to that tree all the way over there. Like, or, see where I'm aiming? From here to there, I could probably, I could hear him if I had awareness on. I can hear his footsteps. Bro, that shit gotta be patched. Not enough people talked about that. I didn't see that as a complaint anywhere. And I watch a lot, like, I watch a lot of streams, I'm always on Twitter, like, I'm a super fucking nerd for this shit, like, I would have seen the comments about it, but I didn't. That's definitely something that's bad. It needs to get fixed, because when the game comes out, and if people catch, when the community does catch on to the fact that awareness is dumb as shit, like, you're gonna get destroyed. I can't believe he sniped me while I was doing all that movement. Um, but yeah, uh, awareness is definitely a bad thing. That shit gotta get fixed. At least the distance. Come on, G. At least the distance. The distance definitely has to get, like, nerfed. It gotta be at least only in, like, the building you're at or some shit. Or just make it <coughs> make it how it is from, like, Black Ops 2. Or any other game that has, like, awareness, you know. Make it strong, but don't make it fucking 20 meters out. You can hear people. Because that shit is... <coughs> I can't imagine that. Like, the whole time. You can just sit in the corner forever. <coughs> you don't gotta move. Now, as far as, like, other bad stuff, I think we, we might be good in terms of, like, bad shit. Um, there might be, like, a little, obviously, you know, every every beta, every game has, it like, glitches, blah, 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 like, that, just little glitches here and there. But I'm, I'm not going to go ahead and make a fucking list of all that shit. Um, uh, I was about to say flash bang, or nine bangs, but honestly, in a battle royale mode, something like that, I say don't patch it, keep it the same. That was almost a voice crack. I'd say because you know it's battle royale. Like who, who, not who really cares, but like uh, in a battle royale, um, if they're overpowered stuff or, or things that are like super strong, almost overpowered, they I I'm cool with keeping them in as long as they're not like holy shit he's gonna win every time if he does that. You know what I mean? Because like you know there's a difference between level three armor. In here, and then level 3 armor in multiplayer. If level 3 armor was in multiplayer, take it out completely. If it's in battle royale, you gotta nerf it in some form. You know what I mean? Like, because this is a different type of game mode. It's not, like, super competitive. Like, it's competitive, but then it's, like, not at the same time. You know what? Like, if that makes sense. Certain things can go in here, but not go in multiplayer. How about, let me leave it like that. If, if you, so, like, to make you understand what I'm saying. So, um, so it doesn't sound like I'm contradicting. You know what I mean? So... Let's move on to the good things. There's like, I could say a million good things about this game, honestly. Like, I ah, fucking, I don't even think I should throw up, throw up like a little graphic of love, um, of like the good things because it'll take up the entire screen. But, um, good things off the top of my head. It's super, it's addicting, you know, just dropping in. Uh, it, there's fucking uh, 80 whatever people. Um, they switched, it, I think they made it 100 at the last minute, but there's like 80 some people, uh, you and your bro, or you and your bro, or you and your bros, you know, just drop in and like, just that, it, it's just super addicting, you know? Things are quick, it's quick COD gameplay, you know, the shit that we know and love, you know, quick snappy type shit, uh, fucking you die fast, they die fast, you kill fast, da, da, da. like that, that's just dope. You can't, there's something about it, COD has this thing, man, 
where it's just like the fact that it's super fucking smooth 60 frames and like fast-paced action there's some shit about that that you can't take away like that's what cod got that forever out of any game that i play cod has that so i'd say like i don't know i titled it the the smoothness or the addictive or, or, or the fun factor of this game is what sets it apart what makes it super like super cool um what what else um the healing i actually fuck with the healing system you know you, you stab yourself you got first days as med kits that's pretty cool that you, you you find backpacks to expand your inventory um perks the perks are cool like i actually fuck with the fact that there's like perks in the game that you could find randomly um what else is super cool the fact that you could put a million attachments on your gun like that's super cool um oh ooh, the biggest good thing about this the fucking the old maps bro i was playing on firing range in like half this gameplay like that's from black ops 1 that is the coolest shit ever come on bro there's raid there's fucking uh what is it there's fringe there's fucking not standoff there's nuketown there's a ray like come on bro how are you really trying to how that shit is dope like it's like a big ass dlc all in one like dude that's so cool you don't even got to pay extra for that you know what i mean like there's no fucking you don't have to pay 20 dollars just to play this map no there's like a billion maps just put together that shit is super cool i love the fact that they made the map like that um it's treyarch you know anything they fucking i'm, I'm gonna be honest i'm gonna say it right now everybody knows this everything they do is it's it, it pops it always pops name one bad treyarch game right now tell me which treyarch game is bad and then let me laugh at you because I guarantee you every community on every game, they were like, yo, this is one of the greatest gods. Black Ops 1. Classic Cold War type era. They did it perfectly. Come on now. Like, do I got to go through every... I can go through every Treyarch card right now. Card right now. Black Ops 2. Futuristic card. They hit. They hit. Literally, that's what made competitive blow up. That's what made, like, Call of Duty even more popular. Like, that was one of the greatest card games of all time. Factor. This is a fact. Uh, Black Ops 3, the best boot, the community, let me, let me tell you from the community standpoint, Black Ops 3 is literally the best boost jump in Call of Duty, I see that everywhere, I see that in comments, I see that in videos, it's literally the best boost jump in Call of Duty, you know, like, what else do I gotta say, I don't know what else I gotta say, like, you know what I mean, we brought, zon like, Treyarch did zombies, <laughs> what, he shitted on me, this guy is a bitch, he camped, he out bitched me, um, what else what else we gotta keep going with the good stuff um the like parachuting everything down to like parachuting is super cool like we're in raid right now from black ops 2 what else do i really gotta tell you what do i have to say i i don't like if you don't think this game is fun like who are you or you're a fortnite nerd cool this is fun <laughs> I was about to, I know, nah, I was going to jump out the window and say that this is better than Fortnite. I wouldn't say it's not better than Fortnite. There's something about Fortnite that you can't, you can't beat out. In terms of Battle Royale, you, this can't beat out Fortnite. Come on. That's, that's a little, I'd say that's a little too much. Fortnite it, it did this thing where, like, if you're not Fortnite, you're not going to beat it in Battle Royale. Um, Game-wise, obviously, I'd play COD over Fortnite. But, I'm just saying Battle Royale mode, no. It's not... I wouldn't say it's not even close, but in terms of fun, this is definitely a very fun game to play. Um, <coughs> yeah, excuse me. What else we got that's super fun? There's zombies. Bro, there's zombies in this game mode. Or like, come on. There's ray guns. Like, dude, there's monkey bombs. How is this not, like, you have to understand. Like, oh, yeah, that's another thing I wanted to bring up. The importance of of this mode and how much of a hit it is the reason why this is so important is because there was this, there's a running narrative or, or not even a running narrative actually yeah it is a running narrative and it's true call of duty is getting boring you know what i mean like there is getting boring because they're making shittier shittier games right they're making shittier games and they're also making dumb mistakes you know what i mean i can name all the mistakes right now in the video but that'll take five, like that, that'll take like three videos. There's just a lot of little mistakes that they did, and um, that made that just that just didn't hit, you know. Uh, Treyarch should be making every single Call of Duty. I don't give a fuck. If, if you're gonna hear my voice in the background, I tried to turn it down so you can still hear the gameplay a little bit, but um, I didn't. I recorded the live stream, so you might hear my audio on top of this. Excuse me, but um, 
this is so this is very important because if this didn't come out if this wasn't as good as it was call of duty definitely would have been even more on the decline than it already is look at fortnite you know the fact that they looked at fortnite said hey let's make a battle royale it was the smartest move they can do i didn't think it'd be that fun but it's actually really fun you got pc players you got fortnite players telling you telling you that they miss blackout go to twitter look at pro players they're saying they miss blackout pro pc players you know what i mean like they're saying they miss blackout how do you miss blackout when fortnite's a thing you know what I like uh, damn bro I'll, I'll let that sit with you i'll let that sit with you for a little bit you know what i mean so it's very important you know it's taking the gaming world by storm it's super fun uh Treyarch, congrats like you did it again uh straight up that's definitely that, that's mostly what i wanted to say in the video so um it's, it's very good very fun very addicting uh very fast paced it's only up from here my advice to Treyarch, what they need to do is take every single piece of advice from the community, all the bad things that they talk about the game, take that and improve on those things. And I guarantee you, this is going to be like competing. Well, 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 I wouldn't say competing with the Fortnite like community because it's this is not free. That's one thing they can do to fully compete and like beat out Fortnite is if they made this mode free. But they'll never do that because they care about money too much. And that is a fact. You can't tell me that they don't because they do. Um, but if this was free, this would take it to that would take it to the next level. Like if only Blackout was free and then you had to pay for the other part of the game, they will never do that. But that I'm telling you right now, Fortnite will be in trouble if they did that. But they're definitely going to still run with the old $60 model and then pay for the DLC. Uh, that should be free. But it's OK. Don't even worry about it. Here's the thing. Um, that's definitely everything I wanted to talk about. Let me know what you think in the comments below. For those of you who really fuck with Black Blackout or just Call of Duty in general, wanted to do this video because it's something I wanted to say for a while. I wanted to discuss this. I like doing discussing videos um, and stuff like that. I talked for like 20 fucking minutes. Um, but that that's like, I could deadass make a, a Call of Duty podcast, you know, and straight up talk about everything from like public to pro level uh, Call of Duty. Um, I love it. Obviously, you know, it's my favorite thing. This is what I want to do. You know, I, I love talking about it. So I had to get this all out. This has been on my mind. And I know it's kind of, it's definitely late. But it, it, I mean, it's late. But then it's not late at the same time because Blackout is still the topic of discussion uh, right now. Um, it's what really got the fucking the Internet buzzing right now. So very dope. So I enjoyed Blackout. I hope you guys did as well. Uh, let me know fucking how how much you enjoyed it i enjoyed it so fucking much and i hate that it's gone i think he had level three armor he shitted on me so show some love and a like if you enjoyed the video and if you really fuck with me and want to see more content like this more disgusting more discussing videos more gameplays and stuff because i can provide that when the game comes out because that's what i'm gonna be doing then subscribe to become part of the task force to be the man with a plenty task at hand remember peace love positivity i can't believe i talked this god dang much and I'm out. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I hope you. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. You know, a nice relaxed fucking discussion video. So, if you want to see more of it, let me know. And peace out. Thank you so much for watching too.